Hello and welcome back to my channel CAD with Jordan. Today we're going to be going over how to create something a little bit like this. This here is my interpretation of a pipe and as you'll see right here inside the pipe is actually completely hollow so it can actually serve as a proper pipe. So let's just jump right in. I'm going to start a brand new part and to begin with I will start a 2D sketch and pick a plane and then obviously you want to put in your inner diameter of the pipe so I'll just do 15 and then the thickness of your pipe and you want to do this with the offset tool which you can access at the top here with, with this button or you can press O and get the offset tool using a shortcut and then going to make the thickness 2mm thick so now that I have my profile what I need to do, do now is select a path for this profile to follow so I'm going to select this plane that way I can start in the very center here and then I can just draw out my line however long I want it to be and there you go so now we should be able to make a straight pipe and obviously you could just do this with the extrude tool but the tool that we're going to be using is known as the sweep tool and the way this works is you need two sketches hence why we've already done that and we're going to select the profile and then we can move over to our path and that'll be this and there we go we have our pipe but it's not really like our 3d one here so the way that we create a 3D or three dimensional like moving pipe is once again, we're going to start off with a with our profile and then we'll finish our sketch. And now we're gonna to move to a 3D sketch and you access this by pressing the drop down button found underneath the start 2D sketch and then you'll find the start 3D sketch and you'll see a bunch of different tools come up but all we're really going to be using here is the line tool or you could use the spline but I'm going to use the line tool and then I'm going to start my my 3D sketch right in the center where of where the pipe's going to be. Now just a little quick rundown of what you can do with 3D sketch is if you select any of these planes then you'll see that you can only then draw on that plane as if it was a 2D sketch. So if I start by doing something similar to what I did before, then I'm going to select this plane and come up at a crazy angle. And then I'm going to have it cut back on itself. And you can see that I'm just selecting which plane I'm going to be drawing on before I start drawing. And then, yeah, that'll do. So that'll be a strange looking pipe. You can see when I move around that this is in fact a 3D sketch. And before I actually do this, what I want to show you is the bend tool here and this is just like adding a fillet in a 2D sketch it will just add a bend in between the lines so I'm going to set my bend radius to 15 mil and I'm just going to run in between all the lines that I created and now we have a bit of a smoother curve that will better represent the pipe so now we have our path and our profile we can use the sweep tool select our profile and then we can select our path and now you'll see that we have a pipe so yeah, that basically covers it. It also shows you a little bit about 3D sketches and a little bit about the sweep tool. Take that on board and begin learning. Speaking of beginning learning, if that's something that you'd like to do, then take a look at the link in the description. That'll take you over to Udemy, where I'm currently selling a course. Usually it sells for like 12 pounds while it's on deals but also keep a look out on my channel because the next video is going to have a hundred percent discount off the course just so more people can learn anyway thank you very much for watching